Dear babies, welcome to listen to today's story. The story shared by Auntie Kiwi today is I want to buy a dream. Author Zhao Bingbo, painting, Sun Bye Bye. Once upon a time, in a big forest, there are a group of cute little animals. This day, the little squirrel is busy picking pine nuts alone in the pine tree. A little red bird flew over. I happily said to the little squirrel, Little squirrel, little squirrel, I had a dream last night. I dreamed of playing with a beautiful big butterfly. It's interesting. After saying this, the little red bird flew away happily. The little yellow bird flew over again and said to the little squirrel, Little squirrel, little squirrel, I had a dream last night. I dreamed of a peacock flower, so beautiful. The little squirrel thought, yeah, what a beautiful dream everyone has. I also have a dream tonight, a beautiful dream. At night, he went to bed early. Close your eyes, waiting for the dream to come. Little squirrel, wait, wait. Slowly fell asleep, but the dream did not come. Little squirrel wakes up. I closed my eyes and thought for a while, hey, I haven't dreamed anything. Why can everyone dream? He was disappointed. Suddenly, the little squirrel thought of a good idea. How about I buy a dream? So he set off. The little squirrel walked to the big lake. I saw a red carp swimming in the water and said, red carp. Red carp, I want to buy a dream. Do you have one? The red carp said, Little squirrel, I don't sell dreams. A white swan fell on the water. The little squirrel said to it, White swan, white swan, I want to buy a dream. Do you have one? The white swan shook his head. Little squirrel under the tree met the little white rabbit playing on the swing. I heard that the little squirrel wants to buy a dream. The little white rabbit smiles with long ears. Shaking and shaking, you can't buy dreams. Squirrel. The little squirrel was very disappointed. Why don't people buy dreams? But can you have beautiful dreams? He went home sadly. It's dark. He thinks I didn't buy the dream. I will definitely not have any dreams tonight. Quiet at night. The little squirrel closed its eyes and breathed gently. I fell asleep before I knew it. Suddenly, the little squirrel started to dream. He had a dream about a big lake. Dreaming. He swam around in the lake with the red carp. Play games together. Then he had another dream about flying. In the dream, the white swan carried it on its back and flew in the blue sky across the lake, over the mountains, flying to a place far, far away. It also had a dream about a swing. In the dream, he was sitting on the swing with the little white rabbit. Swing, 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 swinging into the clouds. He blinked at dawn, reminiscing about the dreams I've had. It turns out that I can have so many fun dreams. The little squirrel was very happy, but he still doesn't he understand. I never dreamed before. Why do you do it now? Okay, the story is over, big baby. Baby, is today's story interesting? Do you like this story? If you like it, please continue to follow. We will continue to share more interesting stories next time.